Japan scored to take a 2-1 lead against Spain, and this goal ultimately knocked Germany out of the World Cup. It was another controversial VAR decision, so let's take a closer look. The ball appears to be out of play when it is crossed for Tanaka to score, but we'll look at the laws of the game and still images to see that it was actually in play. The ball has to be completely out of play, on the ground or in the air, and this includes the curvature of the ball. Here you can see the ball looks like it's out of play until we add a red line on the edge of the goal line, and then add a circle over the top of the ball. Yes, the 3D ball is a sphere, but this circle shows the outside edge of the curvature of the ball, which is the important part. And when we zoom in, we see that there is some overlap between the curvature and the goal line. To disallow the goal, VAR would need to show conclusively that the ball is completely out of play to overturn a clear and obvious error. Because they couldn't determine this from their images, the goal was allowed to stand. It's worth noting that ball tracking technology is not used to determine if the ball is in or out of play. It's only used to determine whether or not the ball has crossed the goal line for a goal to be scored. Again, this is a very tight call by VAR, and it's controversial because it essentially put Germany out of the World Cup. As always, let us know your thoughts and questions in the comments below.